morning, in France. Be a beautiful day for the Republic. What do you want this time? Oh, official orders, Miss Patrick. What we have here is requisition for one large, preferably healthy bovine for the dining pleasure of Major General Philip A. Sheridan. You go back and tell Phil his pocket Sheridan. We're fresh out. Well, begging your pardon, ma'am, but that thing there sure bears a close resemblance to one. She ain't large, and she sure ain't healthy. You'll do just fine. You won't go near her. The mortar's real. Real as they could be, Natty. Well, let's go. Nat, no! That's some good advice, ma'am. And your continued cooperation makes your release to the Union a whole lot more convincing. To hell with the Union! And to yourself, ma'am! Nat, please, it's all ask how you're not gonna let them take the food from our mouth! Let them take what they want and go, for God's sakes, they got orders! No, not anymore! You want a second of help under that, missus? Just stand up and try that once again. Leave her alone! Davy, no! Go! Let's go! We have a woman's got to Don't touch her! Well! What do we have here, huh? You been hiding your itchy cousin there, Daddy? He ain't nobody. He don't want no trouble. I just heard him asking real loud and clear! Behind you! Crazy boys don't do anything well. Forgot to forge the quartermaster seal. Leaving? <laughs> Fine idea. I assume it goes without saying we won't be seeing you here again. Oh, no, no, no. Gentlemen, on foot. I suspect we both know those horses aren't yours. <laughs> Imagine you'll be running now. I said run! <laughs> You a fine fella. I bet you ride real good, huh? Hmm? Yeah, go sit up, Spell. Just like Joe Johnson at Manassas. You see those bulls run? Three cheers for Mr. Lazarus! His name's Lazarus? Yeah, I sent 